The German Spitz is always alert, energetic and exceptionally dedicated to his owner. His natural distrust of strangers and lack of hunting instinct is what makes him the perfect watchdog for your house. Are you considering to purchase a German Spitz? In this video you will learn everything about the breed based on 8 topics, so you can find out if this dog is best for you. Number 1. Origin the German Spitz originates from Germany, and it is one of the oldest dogs out there. The German Spitz has been around for almost 5,000 years, and it's the ancestor of many of our modern breeds. He has praised this breed as a brave protector of their homes and fields. German Spitzes were extremely popular in England during the 18th century among royalty class and upper class. When King George took the throne, he and his wife had several German Spitz dogs. Although they were almost extinct during World War II, they made a big comeback after the war and today they are very popular. Number 2. Personality the German Spitz is a vigorous dog who loves pleasing his family and be the center of attention. They are hyperactive and would rather run outside around the yard than stay inside and cuddle. The German Spitz is watchful and always alert to its surrounding. This type of breed is usually wary of strangers, so they might bark when they see someone they are not familiar with. It is very affectionate when it comes to its owner and forms an exceptional bond with them. Because of this bond, it's likely to accompany its owner everywhere. The German Spitz doesn't like when it's separated from its owner at all, and it might bark a lot if ignored. German Spitzes love to be the center of attention, and they demand affection and love at all times. Number 3. Appearance because of its beautiful coats, the German Spitz is enchanting when it comes to its appearance. German Spitzes have double coats. They have the overcoat, which is straight and long, and they also have the undercoat, which is short and slightly softer to the touch. Particularly impressive is the thickness of the coat around the chest and neck that makes it almost look like a ruff. The double coat is so fluffy that it can make the dog look even bigger than its actual size. The fabulous coat of this type of breed comes in a variety of colors, such as black, brown, orange, wolf grey and white. Its ears are small and point upright whereas his eyes are dark and almond shaped. The German Spitz can grow up to 15 inches, which is 38 centimeters, and weigh up to 29 pounds, which is 13 kilograms. Number 4. Trainability this dog likes to test the boundaries with its owner from time to time by assaulting somebody's slippers in response to an insult which can be real but also imagined. That's why the owner must be level-headed enough to deal with any kind of incident in a firm but reasonable way. Keep in mind that this type of breed creates a strong bond with you and that's why it can be really sensitive to your behavior. The German Spitz is often stubborn and doesn't respond quickly to training sessions. That's why you need to be persistent to yield results. Once the German Spitz is well trained, he will accept the dominance of its owner. You also need to know that socialization from a young age is important to improve the breed's natural suspicion of strangers. If you want to learn more about dog brain training and training methods, check out the description. Number 5. Time Investment to make sure that your German Spitz maintains its health, you should consider doing regular veterinary checkups to detect any health concern early. You can have your vet to develop a care routine to keep your dog healthy. You also need to brush these types of breeds a few times a week to pull away loose hairs and avoid tangles or matting. The German Spitz is inclined to weight gain, and they have high energy levels. You need to make sure that your dog gets a good half an hour to hour long walk per day. It is recommended that you include playing sessions as well. They need at least 30 minutes of exercise per day. You need to trim your dog's nails once or twice per month, as well as check its ears daily and clean them as recommended by your vet. When it comes to taking care of the German Spitz, maintaining its oral health should be your main concern. You should clean their teeth daily, as they are inclined to dental issues. Number 6. Best Home because of the German Spitz's loving nature, he is generally family friendly. This type of breed is very affectionate to babies and children. He's not jealous of them and it's safe to keep a German Spitz around your kid. This type of breed is not hostile towards other pets. Especially when it comes to other dogs, he is friendly. When it comes to strangers, he needs to be introduced properly, otherwise he can be quite unfriendly. The German Spitz doesn't like indoor areas. He prefers a big yard where he can run and play all day long. Although the German Spitz can cope with apartments, a house with a big yard fits him much better. 
Number 7. Health The German Spit is one of the healthiest breeds and has a very low incidence of health problems. As he is prone to obesity, this can bring a variety of secondary problems when it comes to its health. That's why you should be careful when it comes to its diet. Some of the health issues that the German Spitz is more likely to face include collapsing trachea, which causes the German Spitz to have heavy breathing and coughing, and epilepsy, which causes the German Spitz to have a rare brain disorder. This will give the German Spitz episodes of convulsive seizures, as well as altered consciousness. The German Spitz's life expectancy generally ranges anywhere from 13 to 15 years. Number 8. Cost The average price for a German Spitz puppy will be somewhere around $500. If you're looking for a specific look or a puppy with the highest quality and even show quality, you can budget anywhere between $700 and $1,000. So what do you think about the German Spitz? Let us know in the comments and share your experience with other interested dog owners. And if you found this video helpful, it would be great if you subscribe to our channel so you don't miss new videos and learn more about dogs every day. Thank you so much for watching.